hi guys welcome back to my channel claire here with destiny creativity and if this is your first time here i really really welcome you uh today i just want to show you how i made these beautiful paper flowers they are really easy to make a nice add to your wall so let's get into it the first step is to make the paper templates and i'm going to show you how to make these templates so all you need are is uh, paper and we're going to begin with just normal paper and then fold it into two and then um, we're going to use a pencil to just draw like a leaf shape yeah it's basically a leaf shape and we cut it out using the scissors Now that we have the first shape, we are going to use this very shape to guide us as we draw the rest of the shapes as you will follow in my steps. After this, all we need is to trace uh, these leaves onto cardstock paper because it's harder paper. Uh, I already traced out mine, so I won't do that again, but you need them because they are a bit hard, so they will guide you to make all the other leaves that you need. For this project, I used three different shades of pink, as you can see. So the lighter pink was the smallest leaflet, and then the dark pink was the medium and then the other shade was the extra big leaf. Now that I have all my three pieces, the next step is to curve them a little bit. Uh, this is because all of them will be um, curved to make the shape that we need. So, I used a ruler here, but you can use anything that's straight. The ruler was long enough and made my work so easy, So, but you can use anything. And all the three pieces were done. I um, glued them right at the bottom, as you'll see. So the medium piece will go in uh, to the you know big piece and then the small piece will go in last. So this is how the piece looks like. Um, so in total I made 10 pieces of this for the big flower and now we're going to work on gluing them together. The base I used the cardstock paper and this is where I glued all the pieces um, around this paper.
After I noticed the cardstock paper was really weak for this piece and so I decided to put a base uh, using the cardboard um, and this is what I pinned down and it was good, perfect and firm. Um, so for the center piece I just got this paper um, and I cut out a circle and I put for the center. And maybe the other thing I added was a few uh, golden rhinestones at the edges of um, the, the petals using a uh, hot glue. So the next step was to work on the middle flower. So basically I used the two uh, medium and then the smallest uh, shapes to make um, this flower. Basically it's the same steps that you take to make as the one we've used before. For the medium flower, I used uh, nine pieces, but the same steps, and this time I started right away with the cardboard, covered it up with paper, and just uh, glued the petals onto the cardboard. So these medium flowers will be two flowers in total. And um, yeah, this is how they look like, really beautiful. Uh, so the next step is to make the smallest um, flowers. These, I drew another shape, smaller to the shape we had before. And I made four of them, same steps. And this is how they look like. I really, really love these flowers. I used two-sided tape to hang these onto the wall and I'm really obsessed with these pink shades. They look so good. If you did love them as well, please like, share and subscribe. And you can make these flowers in different colors and make different arrangements. Let me know in the comments if you prefer them in another color or another arrangement. Thank you so much. I have other videos as well in my description box. Please don't forget to check them out. Thank you. I'll see you next time. Bye.